Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I thought I would film one of those tags that's been going around, um, what's in my purse. But I thought I would do something a little different and not only show you what I keep in my everyday purse, but also what I keep in my work bag. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, so my everyday purse is this um, crossbody bag. Um, it's like a, like a deep tan color. Um, I got this on Amazon. Um, I've been using this purse nonstop for about a year and a half now. That's how much I love this purse. Um, I want to say it was like 20, $25, $25 or $29 um, on Amazon. I love it because it has the strap and I can just put it, you know, put it on over me and do crossbody. I don't have to worry about setting my purse down. I don't have to like, you know, carry a heavy purse on my shoulder. I just really love this. So before I was using this, I was actually using my coach bag. Um, and I used that one for quite a while. But then once I started using this, I honestly haven't gone back to my coach bag at all. Um, the only time I switch out purses is when I'm going to like Disney and then, you know, I'll transfer certain things into like my Disney bag. Um, but anyway, so this is it. It's got um, two big zippers on the front and then in the back it has a zipper and then it has the main compartment which has one big um, like organization slot that you can put your phone in there and then it has the middle and then it has a back zipper on the inside so let's go ahead and get started I'll show you what I keep on the inside since I'm there already um, let's see what I have in here so I keep my little mini nail clippers no big deal and then my little mini um, glass file. I keep that in there. I got this on Amazon as well. Then I keep my mini toothbrush, a little travel toothbrush. Um, I'm notorious for like, you know, I need my teeth to be clean and you know. So if I'm, and these are really good for like, if you're um, like on a flight and I just want to run into the bathroom and brush my teeth. So I always have that. Then, you know, the little toothpaste. Then I have my library card. Um, you know, it doesn't, my current wallet that I'm using doesn't have enough slots, so I just keep this tucked away in this back part. Um, and then I just have my earbuds, not ear pods, but earbuds. And I bought the, this little thing on Amazon as well. Um, I love these things. It's just like a little snap that you can organize your cords, your headphones, whatever, and I love them. This came in like a pack of... I want to say like 10, something like that, and it was a few bucks. Um, if I can remember, I'll try to link those on Amazon. And then the big pouch in there. Um, this is my current wallet that I use. Um, I got this at Target. It was only a few dollars, but the reason I like it is because it's so skinny. Um, so in the front, it just has my driver's license. Um, I don't keep anything in there. And then this is where I keep my cash. And then in the back, this is where I keep my cards. So I've got my debit cards, I've got my one credit card. Um, this is my BJ's card. This is my Regal for the movie theaters. Um, this is my Ulta rewards card. And then I have in the back slot, I keep my insurance cards. And then, oh, where's my like my um, CPR cards, I usually have them here too, but I don't know where they are. I must have taken them out and put them somewhere else. And then, let's see, in this big spot, I keep my sunglasses. These are just like cheapo ones that I keep. And then in my car is where I keep my, um, what brand are they? I don't know, I forget what brand they are, my expensive sunglasses. So these are just cheapo ones I got from Kohl's. Um, I love these though, I've had these for several years, but they're starting to, fall apart you guys I'm really bummed because I really love the size I think they're really cute um, I've been trying to find like a new pair similar to these but I haven't done any. okay and that's it in the front pouch and then whenever I have my phone I would stick it in this big pouch right here all right so in the back I don't really keep anything in the back but a pen and what is this oh I went I donated some stuff at Goodwill um, and this is just like the little receipt that they gave me and then I just keep a basic pen in the back I used to keep a pad of paper in here, like a little notepad. I don't know why I took it out. I'll have to put one back in. And then in this top zipper, this is where I keep my 
little traveling makeup pouch. I um, got this on Amazon. It came in a pack of three. Um, each one gets slightly bigger. Um, this is like the perfect size. So in here, let's see, I keep my little, um, what are these called? Uh, blotting papers, and it comes with this mirror. I got this on Amazon. This was only a few dollars. And then I also, it comes, you can buy like the replacement papers. And this is really good. I really like this. The snap closure has kind of broken. Um, I was thinking of buying a new one because it's only a few dollars, but at the same time, I mean, it stays shut. It's just, you know, whatever. And then let's see, I have my comb, which I don't really use anymore because I don't really, with my wavy hair, I don't really comb my hair, but this is usually just for like when we go to Disney, if my hair gets, you know, crazy messed up, I can kind of comb it back with some water and, you know. Um, I've got my two chapsticks. I've got my just regular bliss decks, and then this is my Burt's Bees Hibiscus. Um, this is my Hola Girl. I love this thing. It's like a tinted lips, tinted chapstick, but it has so much color. I love and this one's like, I need a new one. It's like done. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, just kidding. Ah, oh, that must have been stuck before because I've tried to get it to come up all the, like several times and it wouldn't come up. So, oh, I guess I have a lot more in there than I thought. Fun. And then let's see. Let me pull out what else I have. So then I have like two bobby pins I just keep in there. This is my little lippy brush in case I need it. Um, whatever lipstick I'm wearing for the day, I will put in here. I don't have one in here right now because you know I've already taken it out. Um, this is my little compact um, that I use for touching up powder, concealer, whatever. I take, um, what's it called, mineral powder, loose powder, and I will press it into one of those little tiny like eyeshadow pants. This pops out. It's hard to get it to come out though, so I'm not going to try. Oh, no, it came out easily. Um, these little eyeshadow pans, um, mineral powder, like foundation powder. I press it and then I just stick it into this little thing. And then this is my touch ups for when I go. I needed to make a new one because this one's like empty and, you know, old and ratchety. Um, so I'll probably do that this week. And it's got this little teeny tiny mirror. So this is perfect just for touch ups. Um, like if I have any blemishes that are, you know, the redness is coming through, I can just touch up. If I get oily, I can, you know, blot with this. And then I will use one of these two little brushes. So I have this little skinny, um, I think it's supposed to be like a skinny eye brush or maybe, I don't think it's really supposed to be a concealer brush, but um, this is from Everyday Minerals and it's just the perfect size. Like look how tiny it is. And then I can just go like this and you know, touch up, you know, as I need to. And then this one was actually an eyeshadow brush and the top, you know, popped off and I was about to throw it in the garbage. And then I was like, oh wait, that would be like perfect to go inside my bag because the head is tiny, but it's, big enough where I can, you know, do this and then I can like do this. Like, you know, so how neat is that? So that's my little travel. That's what I keep in my little makeup bag. And then in the second pouch, um, so I got a bunch of junk in here. Let's keep my little lotion in there. Um, this is just like a little travel one that I got from Target or whatever. And then I just refill this with whatever lotion I'm feeling at the moment. My ibuprofen, I always have ibuprofen on hand. I have chronic headaches. La Roche-Posay eczema cream. This is, f I keep for my youngest son. Um, he gets really bad eczema on his hands. I get it occasionally in between my fingers here, but I don't get it the way he does. He gets it really bad on his hands and he uses essential oils. But when we're out and about, if I notice that he has like a flare up is you know coming on, I give him this to tie them over until we get home. He can start putting his oils in his cortisone cream on. This is my little roller ball that I keep my oils on there so I can um, you know, put it on my cuticles. It's pretty empty, I need to fill that up. And then just some gum. And then this spray bottle was, um, I don't know if they still do this, but this is from like, oh God, I've had this for like 14 years, this spray bottle. Um, like I said, I don't know if they still do it, but. 14 years ago, when we went to Sunglass Hut, where we bought our um, sunglasses, um, you could get a spray bottle, for, like a cleaning spray that you can clean your sunglasses with, and then anytime you would go into a Sunglass Hut, you could give them your spray bottle and they would fill it up for you. Um, I no longer really clean my sunglasses that way, so instead I filled this up with um, 
what is this called? Um, finishing spray, but it's a sunscreen finishing spray. So this has this is by Cool Coolerpa Cool. Colipa, something like that. I got it from um, Ulta. And so I feel, keep it in here. And then when I'm out and about, I can spray my face and then, you know, kind of refresh my sunscreen and also mattify my skin a little bit because this is a mattifying sunscreen spray. So really neat. I was really happy when I found that. And that is everything. I don't keep a whole lot in my purse, you guys. Um, I don't like it to be too heavy. Um, so that's everything that I keep. Let me go ahead and show you what I keep in my work bag. So, in case you guys couldn't figure out by my very clever channel name, Nurse Jackie, I'm a nurse, so I have a lot of things that I need to have with me at work at all times. So, this is my bag. I got this on Amazon as well. Um, I forget how much this bag was. I wanna say it was maybe like $30, but it's a really nice quality. Um, I don't know what you would call this. It's not leather, it's not even really like faux leather. I don't think it's pretending to be leather, but maybe it is, I don't know. But it's really nice, it looks really nice. And it pretty much holds, it does hold everything I need. I wish it was just a little bit bigger, like a little bit wider, or like, like a little bit longer. Um, but it manages to hold everything that I need. I just sometimes, some of the things I have to kind of like scrunch up in here. So it's got this main zipper here in the front. And then it has the big zipper on top, which is where the bulk of stuff goes. And then it has this in the back. So let me go ahead and start from the back. I'm gonna bring it down just so that it's easier. Um, so in the back is where I kind of keep just like spare things that I don't really need. They're just like extra things um, for, you know, if I ever run out of, you know, you'll see in a second. Um, these are just papers that I have to keep on hand. Um, nothing important, just. Okay, so this is where I keep like all of my spare pens, things like that. I keep my um, Apple charger just in case. I've never had to use this because I charge my phone before I go to work and I'm, you know, I don't really have time to be on my phone at work, but you never know, like in any emergency, something could happen, you never know. So I always have a charger. And then this is where I keep all of my oodles of extra pens. Um, I've got like a little marker, thing that they gave me so we can write on the mark the whiteboards but I don't I don't really use that no, no white still in there I should probably just throw it away and then I keep um what the heck is this too uh oh there's another lid that means there's one floating around in here that's opened hmm well I guess not this is just an, oh here it is so another sharpie that I have um, this is an extra badge for my name tag, um, just in case my other one breaks. Another one in case my other one breaks while I'm on duty and then I can you know, have my little name bag. These are my calipers, which I use to measure um, when I'm reading heart rhythm strips. Um, you're supposed to measure them out. I no longer use these because I know how to count without having to like measure. I can use, you know, I'm good at it, I know how to count um, the size. So I no longer need these, I don't feel the need to carry these around with me, so. But I keep them just in case, you know, sometimes, every now and then a doctor will come on the floor and he'll be like, does anyone have calipers? And you know, so then I can give them calipers. And then these are just all my different pens. This is an extra pen light, which I'm sure the battery is dead by now. Yes, the battery is dead by now. So, you know, that can go in the garbage. Well, I guess I could replace the battery. This is just to, oh. Yeah, see, like the battery is like stuttering to come on. <laughs> okay, so let me show you what I keep in the front pouch, this front portion. Okay, so this is my little um, holder that I use. This goes in my pocket um, of my scrubs. I keep this on me at all times. It has my two pens. Um, this one is another pen light in case I need it, but I don't use it. Um, this is my colored pen. I like to use these tricolored pens or Four, it's four. Um, so I will usually write in either red, um, either blue or green. And then the black is if I ever need to write orders in the chart, because it has to be in black. And then the red is if I ever have critical results that I need to write down or anything important that I need to like be able to quickly see my paper and know that's important, I'll use it in red. And then 
these are my hemostats. So they open like that. So we use these um, when we have when we're unscrewing. This is how I use them. Um, when I have a patient who's like IV, I'm trying to unconnect their IV and it like gets stuck. You can use these. You clamp it onto whatever you're trying to unscrew, and it gets a tight grip, and you can unscrew. These are like a lifesaver. Every single nurse needs to have hemostats. And then these are my scissors I use for dressing changes, whatever. This is a list of laminated numbers that they give us, um, all the different units, numbers, cost centers, things like that. And then this little pouch right here is where I could keep whatever I wanted. I could put money in there if I wanted to, like if I ever, I don't carry money with me at work, um, but if I ever were to have my wallet and it had money in it, then I could put it in here so that it's actually on me and I don't have to worry about, you know, someone stealing my money. Um, then I have my marker, my highlighter. Highlighter, we have to highlight the patient. It has these papers that we have to give them. We have to highlight. And we have dry erase boards in every room that we have to write our names, the charge nurse's name, when pain meds are due, things like that. And so we always have to have a marker. So these stay in my pocket with this. These go in my main scrub pocket. And then I have my little Carmex for my lips so they don't get dry. I have a little nail file that I keep and... Um, Whatever these are, no purpose. <laughs> this is my name badge. Um, has my badge on it. Um, this says Nurse Jackie. I had th bought this on Amazon. Keep a little key to open up. Um, we have carts where we put our computers on, and then um, has drawers in it where we can keep, you know, whatever we need throughout our shift, and we lock them. And then this is my little light that I use, my pen light. Doesn't look like much here because it's bright out but in a dark room it's really bright and then let's see I have my lotion and that is it in the front drawer so then in the main pouch there's only a few things that I keep in here this is my little purse that I take for work because um, it's skinny it's you know I can stick it right in my bag um, always has my Advil in there ibuprofen whatever a little hair tie just in case and then usually what I will do is I will just take out my driver's license and one debit card and I'll put it in here and then put this in here and that's how I take to work. I don't bring my purse with me to work. It's not going to fit in here. There's no need. So this is like my little travel purse. I have my water bottle that I always fill up. Then I have my scrub coat. It keeps me warm. The hospitals are always cold even in the summer because you know hospitals are always cold so that you know we don't breed germs and bacteria and then this is my stethoscope okay sorry I forgot to put my phone on airplane mode and my phone just made a loud buzzing noise so um, I was saying so this is my stethoscope um, I got this like seven years ago I bought it online you can have them custom made this is the brand is ultrascope um, it's a really good quality stethoscope I love this it has um, you can put whatever you want on there. I'm trying to cover up my name. Um, so I had a little picture of a nurse put on there, so that's me. And then I also had my last name etched on here. Um, so the thing I love about Ultrascope is they will replace the tubing for life. So I had my original stethoscope had red tubing. And over time, like they can get um, hard and cracked. And so they'll replace it for free. So I had them replace all you do is you go on there, you give them your email, whatever email you ordered from, and they'll replace it with whatever color you want. I ended up going with black this time. Um, and I really love the stethoscope, so that's like, I love it. And then in the inside pouches, I don't really keep anything. Um, sometimes if I have like a snack or something, I'll put it in there. Um, and then in this back pouch, this is where I keep my little bag of teas and my um, carb-free sugars then I have my toothbrush and toothpaste <laughs> I've got some gum in there which this is probably really old I don't typically chew gum at work I don't typically chew gum at all but I always keep it because you know every now and then I want some gum this is my um, carb low-carb um, creamers um, 
This is just the powdered kind. And then I have these little non-dairy, um, what brand is this? Coffee Mate creamers. So these are like, I want to say it's like one carb or something. So if I ever have to have coffee at work, um, I don't have to worry about, oh, you know, no creamer. The creamers, they're like, you know, full of carbs. And, you know, I do keto, so I don't want to waste a bunch of carbs for a cup of coffee. So I always carry this with me. And then this last thing, so this is my, um, I'm not going to open up and show you, but this is a little pouch. This is my period cup. So I don't use pads or, you know, tampons. I use period cups. So this is my extra one that I keep in my work bag um, in case, you know, starts while I'm at work. And then also just has little liners in there, so a couple liners in there. So and this is a blossom cup, which I love. So that is everything that I keep in my bag. Um, I actually just purchased another purse, um, the one that I originally have, but in another color. So this is a taupe one. It's called taupe, but it looks more like just like a, looks more like a mushroom color to me, but it's the same purse. And then I also bought um, a new wallet. Um, I got, what is this called? Like an RFID, RFID wallet that's supposed to be like for safety um, because in, Orlando, there's been a lot of credit card and debit card skimming. It's like going rampant in East Orlando. So I decided to get a new wallet so that when my cards are in my wallet, thieves walking by can't like electronically steal my credit card information or debit card information. Um, so this one it has a back zipper, which is really nice. You can put coins in there. And then the front opens up little spot, uh, slot for my debit card, or my um, driver's license. Then it has all these slots for debit cards. Um, and then it has all these slots for more cards. And then it has a little zipper in the back that you can keep cash in. So this is really nice. I'm gonna go ahead and transfer all my stuff into this, and this will be my new purse. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.